Hello, everybody. Hello, hello. Come on in. Join us for this Facebook Live. I am Dondi Dolan. I'm Donna Eden's daughter <laughs> and welcoming you to this Facebook Live. I'm coming to you from San Diego, California, and I have a very, very special guest today who is coming in from the UK, from the Isle of Wight, Miss Madison King, and I'll be introducing you to her in a couple of moments. We wanted to come on today because we have such an exciting weekend coming up called the Energy Healing Weekend on September 11th, 12th, and 13th. And we know you want to know all about it. We've been getting questions and emails. So in short, it's three days online, live, nine teachers, everyone from the incredible Jean Houston, Donna Eden, David Feinstein, Lee Harris. We have Vishen Lakiani from Mind Valley. We have incredible teachers going in depth about energy healing, about healing the mind and the soul and the body. And I just want to say really fast before we, we get into Miss Madison and what she's teaching during the weekend, I want to say, you know, this is not a summit. Summits are wonderful. Summits are these events online where you get a bevy of speakers and they all talk to you for about a half hour and you get little pieces of what they do. That is not this. This is an in-depth weekend. Each teacher, each presenter will be on for at least an hour. Most of them will be on two hours going in depth with techniques and real practical, well, practical practices that you can take into your life after the weekend is done that you will have for the rest of your life. We're also giving all of the recordings. And I know while I'm talking, I know that there are some folks putting the link into the comments below. So look for that link. You can click there after this Facebook Live, see more information, see what it's about, see if it's for you. But I'll tell you, I know it is for you. We're going to have Dawson Church talking about bliss brain and how you can wire your brain for happiness. And actually, that really is part of the theme of the weekend. Vishen Lakiani will also be talking about this this uh, this meditation to take you more into joy. So not just joy and bliss while you're in meditation, but joy and bliss that will take you through your life after the meditation. So we'll talk about that a little bit more, but right now I want to introduce you to Madison King. She's an incredible practitioner, a writer, a healer, a teacher. She's been in practice for over 30 years doing many different modalities in natural healing and primarily Eden energy medicine. She studied closely with Donna Eden, came to the United States, traveled with my mom, Donna Eden and my mom, all over the world. And they taught at many places throughout Europe and the United States. And Madison is on our faculty. She also runs our entire European program. So if you don't know, if you're just popping in, we have a certification program. And that certification program is four years of study, a journey with us. And it can take place in North America, but also in Europe. And Madison runs that program. So Madison, I just want to say hello and welcome you. Welcome, welcome to this Facebook Live. <laughs> Oh, Dondi, thank you so much. I mean, in your introduction, you were so lovely to be reminded of the journey we've made together with your mum and that Donna Eden. It's, it's, <laughs> and it's wonderful to be here, and I'm so looking forward to that, that weekend. I really am very well, honoured. Well, we are too. Thank you. It's, it's a time when we really need healing, don't we? We, we really need healing 
in this world. And so let's talk a little bit about your class. You are mm -hmm. teaching a class on abundance. Now, I know that you are a master of what you teach. However, yeah. I'm going to play devil's advocate because when people hear energy and abundance and create the energy of abundance, it can sound really strange. It can sound really unbelievable. Mm -hmm. Like, what does that even mean, an energy of abundance? And what, is money going to start flying into my life? Or are all my relationships going to be better? Again, it, for, especially for someone who has a cynical mind, that just sounds really unreachable. So can you talk to us about the energy of abundance? And this is what you're going to be teaching in the Energy Absolutely. Healing Weekend on September 11th, 12th, and 13th. Absolutely, Dondi. I like to think of it as, as learning how to connect to that universal piggy bank up there, okay? And that is really hard for some people to, to, to um, conceive that idea. Um, either because someone is cynical, and I really respect that, and I love changing the minds of cynics with some of these very easy techniques, um, but also sometimes when you are, and this is, at this particular time, a lot of people are trapped in a feeling of great hopelessness. Okay, where on earth is all this money going to come? Oh, I'm going to tap a few points and I'm suddenly going to become a millionaire or something. I can really understand and relate to that feeling. And that's what this class is about, really, is changing that feeling of hopelessness oh, it can't work for me, how is it going to work for me? I can't see a way of it, you know. Changing that hopelessness, that lack of belief, into a feeling, an energy of hopefulness. And I say an energy of hopefulness because every single emotion has an energy. Um, we know that in, in, in Eden Energy Medicine, and I think most people are aware of that. So it is about, you've got to know how to ask for the energy to change, how to recalibrate, okay, and just begin to build that belief. It's not going to come overnight if you're going through really tough times, but what does happen with people who really are in tough times is they do these techniques, and this is the feedback I've had, which has is, is been amazing, and it's happened for me personally as well in the past. They start doing it, and the universe, if you want, and I use the word universe with tongue in cheek, it could be anything you believe, it's an energy out there, begins to deliver in small ways. And it's up to you to notice those small ways. So you might be walking along the road and suddenly you'll find a dollar, a euro, a pound, whatever it is. And it's recognizing, ah, something's beginning to come in. Thank you. That little attitude of gratitude, acknowledgement for what's being provided. And then things up more things come in and they get bigger and bigger as they go along but it is all about not sabotaging this energy this universal energy of abundance of prosperity with that feeling of hopelessness of of doubt and creating an energy of belief of trust and it takes time and it, it takes a little bit of work okay but it doesn't cost anything so that's the great thing about this, Donda. You can work on yourself, doesn't cost anything, and it delivers. Yeah. Well, thank you for saying that. And I want to go a little bit deeper in that. So I know your work, and I know this isn't just positive thinking or yeah. thinking positively, but I want you to tell everyone who's listening that this what is this? It's not just theory. You aren't going to talk to us for two hours about how to create an attitude of gratitude, even though we firmly believe that an attitude of gratitude helps the energy shift. There are many things that can help energy shift, but you're actually going to give us practical techniques that shift the energy in our body, in our, in our mind. Is that right? Yeah. Absolutely. Okay. No, I, I could. I do waffle on a lot and I could waffle on for two hours about an attitude of gratitude and thinking positively. And I don't demean that in any way. I'm a true believer in that. But what I want to pack into this class is practical tools, because some of you will be thinking, oh, yeah, whatever, you know, but 
to give you practical things that you can do for yourself, little tips and techniques. So there'll be certain little things, um, for example, like don't, don't, put, don't leave your toilet seat up or something, you know, or the abundance goes, you know, there'd be fun little tips like that. And there will be other practical techniques to actually change the energy around the concept of prosperity and abundance. But the core to this, which I'm going to introduce to people, is that area beyond your conscious control. It goes beyond the vocabulary you use and the positive thoughts, the positive thinking. It goes deep into you to an area that I call mini-me. It's beyond your conscious control. If mini-me believes it's not safe for you to prosper, you don't deserve it, you're not worthy of it, oh no, that's bad juju. You're selfish if you're thinking about money. All this thing goes on you know, the conditioning, the program that we've had in our past. Um, I know I had to deal with that a lot, that selfishness, because um, I was very much programmed in my youth to think that wanting to have some money in my purse made me naughty girl. That's evil. That's bad. That's selfish, you know. So, you know, all these things get programmed in and mini me, they become her or his reality. So I'm going to give you practical techniques to go in and talk to mini me to reprogram recalibrate so that your energy is in alignment with that of prosperity and abundance but also mini me is going yeah i buy that i'm going to support you in that i'm not going to sabotage you and suddenly it becomes easy once you have mini me on board suddenly it begins to flow Sometimes it's a little trickle at first. You know, that flow is just, as I say, you find a dollar on the street or a pound or a euro or whatever. And then suddenly someone buys you a cup of coffee. you out with a friend. And I was like, no, 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 I'll pay, I'll pay. And they say, no, 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 I'll pay. You know, oh, I'll pay, I'll pay, I'll pay. Accept, learn to accept that coffee because it's the universe giving you abundance. You know, and if you're saying, no, 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 I'll pay. The universe is thinking, or that energy is thinking, well, she's declining my abundance of this cup of coffee so it's all these little gradual steps up um, to a stage i think where this workshop is not about making everyone a millionaire because that's not necessarily true wealth fine if you want to but you know what true abundance is is not having to worry when the bills come in somehow money always making their make its way to you when you need it it's not a huge issue. You're not frightened of losing your money. You're not like, oh, that's mine and I'm keeping it and I don't want to lose it. It's about that flow of energy. It comes in and it goes out and there's an ease about it. Sorry, I'm getting a bit carried away here, Dondi, but No, it's absolutely <laughs> true. And it's incredible when it happens. My mom and I often talk about this, that when you make that shift energetically how the bills get paid how there's enough money to pay the rent yeah. how there is plenty of money left over it really feels like magic when it happens and one of the themes we talk about themes in the weekend we have many things going on in our energy healing weekend and that's why we're talking to you today coming up september 11th 12th and 13th one of the other themes is doing practical exercises and i mean physical techniques that are easy i don't mean like getting up and jogging around. I mean, Eden energy medicine techniques and other energy techniques that actually change the chemistry in the brain. They yeah. change the chemistry in the brain. Your energy has changed. And once you enter energy medicine and the shift takes place in your life of that energy changing, everything blossoms and opens up. So thank you for explaining all of that. And without turning this into a comedy hour, I have to talk about the toilet seat because you mentioned it. So 25 years ago, this woman who was working in feng shui was an acquaintance of mine. And I was asking her, well, what little things can I do around my house, you know, for more abundance? And, you know, there's, 
There are some things that sound really funny, but painting your front door red, closing your toilet seat. And she said, well, first things first, just close your toilet seat. And I was like, well, why should I close my toilet seat? What? Oh, you mean the germs? And she's like, well, yeah, the germs. But the abundance, the money starts coming. And I'm like, you're nuts. I didn't say that to her, but in my head, I'm like, you're yeah. nuts. My, your eyes probably said it, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> so the toilet seat is a thing, yeah. people. But we're going way beyond the toilet seat. We're going our- way beyond the toilet seat, okay. But there are also, I've got a few other things like the toilet seat, okay, which I'm convinced work. And I'm going to tell you one very quick thing now. Years ago, when we were checkbooks, I hardly ever write a check now, but someone said that first check must be pay Maddie King 20 million or billion pounds. And you write it out and then you sign it, the universal banker. Okay. And I have always done that for, I know, 25 years on my checkbook and I've never gone overdrawn. I've always got money in my bank. (laughs) Now I'm a bit sort of reluctant to stop doing it because I'm convinced that that's an energy that's a message I put out you know to the universe well it's true I've had other people tell me this some some very big famous names in our world have told me I still write that abundance check to really? myself the money <laughs> flowing but okay. Maddie can you tell us maybe another little uh, story do you have a client or uh, maybe a student and and you have taught them abundance techniques and their lives have changed. Can you tell us something to kind of paint a picture for us before we end this Facebook live? Yes, I can. I can tell you a couple of very quick stories. Okay. And this is the great thing that I love about teaching this, you know, it's giving people the tools to do it and then they do it. And then I get the stories back. And it varies, but one, st- one story sticks out with one student. I was doing a, a retreat in Egypt. This is many years ago, and it was an all-in thing, so it was quite expensive for people. Everything was covered for them, and a woman signed up. In those days, it was sending a check. There was no real sort of, you know, pay- PayPal or anything. And she sent the check and she came in and we were having a great time. And under the pyramids one night, we were at the, out at another pyramid doing a, a, a meditation there. She said to me, you know, the universe got me here. I did not have the money for this. And I just did your um, abundance thing. It suddenly came into my head and I did it. And she said, within a week, a check arrived for the exact amount of your course, your retreat. Okay. And what had happened was she, well, I better not in case it reveals her identity, but she had been owed some money and she'd been owed it for about eight years and it wasn't coming. She did those, the simple things I'm going to share with you at this, in my class, she did them sort of thing. Yeah. Well, yeah, I think they're good. It's going to work. It's going to work, you know, and it came, but the exact amount, the exact amount. And often you find that, you know, when people need something, I've got to pay this bill or I've got to pay that, you know, suddenly if you do this work, the money comes in and it's a little bit unnerving when you think that's exactly what I needed. Not a penny more, not a penny less. And I'll tell you one very quick story because I have been doing this for decades and it's worked for me but every now and again I get really like oh my goodness this works I wrote a little book on it and the day I sent and so consequently I'm working you know I worked a lot on myself as I was writing the book far more than usual and so really that I think the universe is getting fed up that universal piggy bank would think oh shut her up with this you know anyway Um, The day I sent that manuscript to the publisher, a letter arrived, a letter from America arrived from the pension fund of an advertising agency I'd worked in like 40 years ago or something, and I hadn't moved my little pension pot from them. They had tracked me down and they had said, we've got this money for you. How do you want it? Now, first of all, do you ever heard of a pension company tracking you down, especially in another country? You know, it's normally it's up for, up for you to sort of go to there. And it was just 
so fantastic that it came in on the exact day I sent my manuscript off on abundance. So, you know, it's, it, it is exciting. It's exciting to see whether it's a pound or a euro or a dollar or 20, 20,000, you know, it comes in and it's cumulative, Dondi, because as, as these little things happen, you, you build that trust, you build that belief and that in turn is much, you'll become much more of a beacon for prosperity because of that belief. So yeah, there's, but lots yeah. of stories and that's a part of my job. I really love hearing people get money creatively and that's the thing if you're not sure how the universe is gonna provide this money don't worry about it it's not your job the universe gets creative and it's just breathtaking in its creativity sometimes well it is breathtaking and i love how you said we're beacons in our work we often say we're magnets and we are we're electromagnetic mm. beings and we can attract in Okay. the good things, the abundance, and it's real. So let me talk a little bit more about the weekend. This is September 11th, 12th, 13th. It's called the Energy Healing Weekend. We have incredible speakers. We'll be talking about Bliss Brain, doing meditations, the vagus nerve, which is huge. If you don't know about the vagus nerve, Donna Eden is doing a class on the vagus nerve and just how it impacts your life for the, for the good and the challenging. We'll have sound healing. We'll have Marcella Lobos. She's a shaman from South America, married to Alberto Violdo, and she'll be doing the hero's journey and the right of the womb. And the right of the womb is not only for women, it's for men too. It's healing the divine feminine. We'll have Qigong, we'll have intuition, Maddie's giving us manifesting mm -hmm. abundance, freeing yourself from pain with Junia. We'll have live music with Karen Drucker. And if you don't know Karen Drucker, we're going to come on this week for another Facebook Live, I think on Wednesday. So watch our Eden Energy Medicine programs page. And Karen will be coming on. She is exceptional. She grew up with Carol King. Actually, Carol King was her babysitter. Karen Drucker manifested that talent and that music, and she plays all over the world. You can hear my little birds right now. They're going off. It's just a clock, but on the hour it chirps. <laughs> so you'll have Karen Drucker. You'll have my sister, Titania Dolan, doing energy medicine dance, which is a movement that incorporates Eden energy medicine techniques to music. You don't have to be a dancer. It's just about getting up or staying in your chair and moving with the different techniques and the music. So we have lots of fun planned. We have 50% off right now, 50% off. So go to the link. I know it's in the comments below. Read more about the weekend. You're going to find so much available to you for that weekend to really take the next step into your life. So many of us are taking the next step after COVID, after lockdown, after quarantine, after some of you have even dealt with illness and being bedridden. Come to the weekend, take the next step into your physical health, your emotional health, and your joy, because joy is just so important to keep your health alive in your body and mind. You will get access to all of the recordings. Remember, 50% off right now, you'll have those recordings for a lifetime. But I also want to tell you something exciting. We just added two bonuses. Oh my gosh, one of the bonuses is live with Donna Eden. Two hours live with Donna Eden sometime after the weekend, after September 11th, 12th, 13th. We will set up a day where she is going to give two hours and you get to ask anything you want. It doesn't have to just be about Eden energy medicine. You can ask Donna Eden about what it was like to grow up and have the ability to see energy 
you'll be able to ask her anything and she's just going to be there answering all your questions. So that's one bonus. We'll also have another bonus, a download called the nine energy systems. Now in Eden Energy Medicine, we work in nine energy systems in the body. And if you're popping onto this Facebook Live and you're thinking, what are the systems? What are the systems? Well, you've heard of some of them, the chakras, the meridians, the aura, but there are nine of them that we go deep into and you will get a download or an upload, upload, download, I always get the words mixed up, you'll get access to that class of the nine energy systems. And so you'll have that as a bonus. So we're adding bonuses, 50% off energy healing weekend. Come to that weekend, click on the week. Miss Madison King, do you have anything else you would like to say before we sign off? Yes, I just want to say one thing, you know, just switch into that universal piggy bank, you know, enjoy and feel nurtured by increased abundance in your life. Because when the stress of that area goes from your life, it frees up so much of that energy to enjoy life, to, you know, to help to, to give you energy on your spiritual journey, on any journey you want. So it's immensely liberating. And Dondi, I can't wait for this weekend to listen to everyone else's talks as well. I'm going to be at every single class. They sound fabulous. They really do. I know. Me too. I'm so excited. And it's all live. And these incredible masters like yourself are going to be with us. And we just get to soak it up. Mm -hmm. So thank you for being with us today. Thank you, everybody out there in Facebook land, and we'll cross post this to YouTube. So hello to our YouTubers as well. And we will see you on September 11th, 12th, and 13th for the Energy Healing Weekend. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm.